Have you ever wondered how to retrieve pick list values in a Salesforce flow? This can be really handy when you're trying to set a value on a pick list, but you need to verify that the value is actually there so you don't end up with an error in your flow. This can be done with three simple steps. First, you want to use a get records to find the entity definition of the object with containing the field you're, you're trying to find the values for. So in my circumstance, I'm getting the entity definition of the opportunity object. Next, you'll want to use a get records to find your field definition. And this field definition is for the pick list field. So you'll define your qualified API name as the field that you're looking for. Mine is company C. Um, and you'll also want to define the entity definition ID, which will be pulled from the entity definition get records. And third, you can finally retrieve your pick list values with a get records and the object is pick list value info. You'll want to define your entity particle ID um, as the ID from the entity definition get records. From here, you can do various things. Uh, you can loop these pick list values if you need to. In my circumstance, I am checking to see if the value I want to select is actually a valid value. <clears throat> so I'm using a filter to filter this get records containing the pick list values. And I'm just searching for the value that I'm hoping will be in that list. So if this filter has a value and it's not null, then I know the value I'm wanting is actually in the uh, values for the field. And then I can go on to update the record. Thanks for tuning into our channel. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please give it a like and ring the bell. And if you have any Salesforce related questions or needs, feel free to reach out to any of us here at Cloud Adoption Solutions.